We're now at a time whose idea has come. Industrial strength, royalty-free video, with a high-quality open source implementation, and, as you'll see, broad industry support. More importantly, you will also have millions of kitten videos. <laughs> as of today, I'm very pleased to share with you, YouTube will be supporting the WebM video format as part of its HTML5 beta. They started converting their entire catalog, beginning with, eight, with the higher quality videos at 720p and above, and that will continue over time. With this, you can use high quality video built into the stack with great performance. <laughs> Mozilla has been interested in, HTML, in open video for a long time because we want to see HTML5 reach its full potential. Since Firefox 3.5 almost two years ago, we've been shipping the open source Fiora codec and working with those developers who are visionaries, really, in seeing the importance of universal video very early on. We're excited that they're joining with us as well in supporting the WebM project and have already started working on the code and uh, tools. Video is key to the web experience. And because of that, it needs to be part of the web, not just technically, but also in terms of, the, in, in the terms of its use. JavaScript, CSS, HTML, SVG, HTTP, all of these technologies are usable under, with no strings attached, under any terms you want to build anything you want. We wouldn't accept that HTML was only, usable, was only licensed to be used for documents and not applications. We wouldn't accept that you couldn't distribute what you do with CSS unless you signed a license. We've seen what happens and how much disruption it can cause when the terms of a platform change at the whim of one organization, and the web needs to be above that. The web's growing important capabilities. <laughs> to be clear, I didn't, I didn't make that happen. <laughs> the web's growing important capabilities, and as it does that, the demands on browsers increase. We're working at Mozilla to make sure that every part of the stack is ridiculously fast. This means taking advantage of graphics on computers and mobile devices. It means taking advantage of multiple cores and DSPs, and, as you'll see, hardware from other WebM partners. The VP8 codec itself, in taking advantage of multiple cores, specializing for, for low-power and embedded devices, is not only a great codec for today, but it will scale with us as the web does in the future. I say every year that it's a great time to be a web developer, and every year I get to be right about it, at least that. Open video is now here in high quality, excuse me, high quality and it's embedded into the stack. It's part of everything you use now, like text, like images, like CSS. Let me give you a taste of what you can do when it's built into the stack and you can use it with all the tools that you've come to love over the past 10 years of the web. This is something we built with two videos, a handful of images, and about 450 lines of HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and SVG. Anybody in the room can read through it, understand it, use it in their own space. No external libraries, no obfuscation. It's all right there. You get real text built into the platform. You can select it. You can localize it. You can search index it. You can animate it. You get robots in circles exploding and shooting at each other. You get high quality video with custom controls, scaling, 720p HD resolutions built into the platform to give you control over the video experience and about how users will find it. It's, it won't surprise you to discover that Firefox will be supporting WebM. It would surprise you to discover we weren't. But we, we don't, our ambitions don't, don't end there. We want to see this in all browsers, on all devices. We want to see this available to every user who's going to, to take advantage of the great things you people are going to build on top of this platform. We've got, we've got nightly builds kicked off today. You'll be able to take them and start, start building your applications now. And I want to thank you, excuse me, <laughs> as we get this technology out to 400 million users on MAMO and Android devices as well, I want to thank you for your time today, and I want to thank you for building a fantastic web. <laughs>